the Tolnar. The ninth race in Ashes of Creation and the culmination of all of that breeding that's been happening underground for hundreds of years while some sort of apocalypse happens above ground and everybody else dies are now looking to not be in Ashes of Creation's Alpha 2 testing environment at the start. This comes from a few things. First of all, Steven took a to Discord to state that the Tolnar are currently not being worked on. Well, you might be thinking, why are the Tolnar not being worked on? It's part of Ashes of Creation. And is Intrepid just ignoring them or what? Well, no. Right now, Intrepid is in full-blown, let's get Alpha 2 ready to go mode. And I imagine their priorities right now are only the things that we are going to see at the start of Alpha 2 and not the things that are gonna be introduced later down the road. That's not being said that the Tolnar haven't been worked on because we've seen concept art of them and we've seen the model of their foot with like a gray box, kind of weird. But at this moment, I don't think it's a priority. And more to back this up is somebody actually made a Reddit post before Steven said this in Discord, the title of it being the Tolnar are missing. And the post says, I've been involved since Kickstarter and am a fan of this project and also the development in the game. But since the last year, there's been no information at all regarding the Tolnar, not even art concepts of houses slash characters. And I'm a little worried that you will delete the race. Well, obviously Intrepid's not gonna delete the Tolnar. They were a Kickstarter goal. We've seen the Tolnar work in progress. And again, I don't think it's their priority. Somebody then commented which Steven replied to we'll get to in a minute that says when we look at what Steven and some of the developers have said about the presentation especially during live streams it seems they have decided to go dark on things where there's nothing new to report or in their opinion not enough regarding the current state of the project I think that the reason we haven't heard much of the Tolnar is because the development on them is currently not progressing much the reason being Intrepid is aiming at making the Alpha 2 version ready this could mean that there won't be any Tolnar to play when Alpha 2 launches that the Tolnar are not yet in a presentable state for reveal, or that the other topics on their list to cover take priority over presenting the Tolnar due to Alpha 2 drawing near. But as of now, I'd say the risk of Tolnar being deleted from the storyline is below 5%. Steven has been very protective of lore elements in his world, and the Tolnar are a part of the canon and essentially at that as a driving force to reconnect the people who fled to Sanctus with Vera again. And then Steven commented stating, Nicely said, friend. Between this and the Discord post, we can say for a fact Tolnar aren't being worked on. Tolnar, if not being worked on right now, more than likely are not going to be in Alpha 2 at launch, which is ramping up soon and honestly, they would be being worked on if this was something that was priority for them in Alpha 2, and I don't think it is at the start. Tolnar, I think we're going to see the least amount of throughout the Alpha testing and even the betas because there is a lot of lore behind them, and like the Reddit post said, Steven has been very close to the chest with certain pieces of lore. I've even asked Tolnar questions in the Q&As in the developer streams before, to which Steven said, But uh, how can I answer that question? Eh, I'm not going to give an answer to that you question. You don't have to. Which was a little disappointing, but you know is what it is, and I get it because you don't want to spoil everything before the game is actually launched. There is going to be a lot that is kept close to the chest. Even with this being open development, Intrepid's not going to show us everything. There is a reason we've only seen the Riverlands. There is a reason that we've only seen minimal lore details on certain things. We haven't seen all the races to their full extent, and it's just not going to happen at 100% because you want there to be a sense of discovery when the game launches. You don't want to go through the alpha testing and the beta testing and have seen the entire game because that is going to take away from the entirety of exploration when Ashes of Creation launches. Yes, the worlds will be mixed up a bit because of nodes, and all of that, but you're still not going to want to take that away. You're going to want new zones for people to explore that they haven't seen in the alpha testing and the beta testing. You're going to want to see different starting zones that they maybe haven't experienced, and it's kind of just the way Intrepid is handling the testing thing. So I guess we'll have to sit back and wait a little bit longer before we get our hands on that Tolnar. Let me know your thoughts on this in the comments down below, and as always, be sure to click that subscribe button, hit that thumbs up, and turn on the bell for notifications as you stay tuned for a lot more to come.